Your AI. So. We. You the big scout that everyone's been talking when about. NBA datang ke sini. So what you think, man? Am I finally walking? Look. Coach Keller might seem like he has a bag of marbles in his head, but the dude knows the game. <laughs> that doesn't really answer my question, but I'm here, aren't I? Something's still missing. Look, Marcus Young. Kid can play. A lot of eyes on him, too. What's with you, man? I I try to ask you a direct question, and all I get is this runaround. Like, I don't understand. There you go. Like the world owes you a spot in the NBA. All I do is work. That's all I do. Then I just can't get a break. That's my problem. You said it yourself. Something is missing. Don't ask me for answers you already have. Well, so Marcus has this all figured out and I don't? Yeah, Maybe. Yeah. Look, I like Marcus' game. I've never talked to him. I don't know him. I do know you. People are starting to talk about you. You're making people's boards. Scouts are looking at you. But there are a lot of other guys out there, too. And what separates you? Mm. Why should I pick you over Marcus? Whoa. Um, what are we doing right this now? Is, this is my, my teammate, um, Howie. Yeah, I know who he is. His form is impeccable. It's a work of art. <laughs> the rest of his game is basically rec league, but <laughs> his form should be taught in books. You're Big Toonie, right? I am. Well, why is my hand going through you like it does with other ghosts? No, no. Nope. We're not doing... No. Nope. The point is, AI, you're close. One missing piece. He did say that thing about my jumper, right? I, di I didn't just dream that? Who raised you? That's what I want to know. No, because I'm going to make my future no. children so sick of that story, it's going to be great! Mm. Listen, I, I want you to start NBA selling NBA. what Marcus Young is going to be six months from now. Then they're going to turn around real quick. Exactly. See, you and I are going to do great things. Watch. So I'm in Texas right now. We have one more game against the Vipers, but then after that, I want you to. Yeah. Uh, I'll call you back tomorrow. I didn't hear you. It's your room too. You could take a call. Yeah, but I just didn't want to take it in the hallway because everybody would hear me asking, like, Marcus, what's going on? You know. <laughs> you know how it is. Yeah, yeah, man, I get it. Yeah. Only a matter of time. All right. Well, um, you know what? I'll let you get back to it. And uh, I'm sure you got a few more phone calls nah, to make. No, nah, no, nah, I got too much energy. I'm about to go get a run in. You can take the room. Plus, you look real tired anyway. You know, there's more to this game than taking the last shot and getting your numbers. Corey Harris taught me that. Oh, really? Tell me more. Were you guys on the beach with the stars? <laughs> man, go take your walk, man. I met plenty of people like you, AI. You know nothing about me, bro. You think you're special? You think the whole world revolves around your thoughts, your feelings? I got a family and people counting on me just like you. There's 491 players in the NBA. Most of them, like Corey Harris, they blue blood, so everything was just handed to them. The rest of us, we down here, we gotta fight for the few spots that they didn't take. So if the only chance I have is by stepping over my competition, I'm going to do that by any means necessary. And right now, that's you. You better believe if I got to go through you, I'm going to slice you right down the middle and clear that path. It doesn't have to be that way, man. It does have to be that way. And you know it. Even though your little girlfriend downtown got your brain off. Don't you dare bring her into this. Whoa. Don't you dare talk about her. Whoa. Don't you dare. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Touch the nerve. Keep talking, man. I dare you. Keep talking. Hey, hey! Knock it off! Knock it off, guys! You lay one hand on him, and you're benched against the Vipers, okay? You too, Marcus. I'm serious. I don't know what started this, and I don't care. It ends right here, right now. You got me? Do you got me? Yes, coach. Yeah, coach. Come on, guys. I came up coaching high school volleyball, okay? And those kids never gave me this amount of grief. Not once! By the way, it's a very complicated sport. Don't know that I ever fully got it. That's beside the point. 
Get your gear. You're rooming with Howie now. Oh, dude, awesome. Yeah, we just gotta get you some earplugs. Oh, Howie, do us all a favor, dude. Go to the drugstore, get one of those nasal strips, staple it to your nose. Well, no, Doc says it's hereditary. It's so. not hereditary, dude. I'm telling you, okay? You have a serious medical condition. And the rest of you guys, why don't we try to act like adults, okay? It's clearly hard for us to behave like basketball players, so let's just be adults. All right, let's go, guys. Let's go hit the showers. Tom and Harriet Banks are the lucky winners of this past weekend super lottery draw. The pair came forward to claim the million dollar prize. Oh, it smells like exhaustion and sadness in here. You're lucky I got some medication. Uh, why does this look like something I need an alibi for? I know how you get hard on yourself, okay? So I was walking back from the pharmacy, anti-snore strips in hand, when I ran into this guy in the alley. And he looked tweaky, but he knew a guy who called a guy, and... BAM! <laughs> whoa, 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 hey. Pretty sure fireworks are illegal here, bro. Not when we're five miles from the Mexican border. Mmm, somehow that makes him sound more illegal. Will you relax? Fireworks are legal within city limits, and since we're in the middle of nowhere, you can lighten up, my friend. By lighting up. What do you say? Uh, uh, nah, man. I'm gonna stay in and get some rest tonight. I'm sorry. Hey, but you go, okay? You have fun. Come on! I'm only gonna ask one more time. Okay. Ask me again. Come outside and light some more fireworks with me. No. <laughs> You'll change your mind. <laughs> okay. You will. Have fun. The annual Hidalgo Rotary Club dinner. We hope to see you there, cowboy. For those of you who like tacos and the Rotary Club, this is a no-brainer. That's the Hidalgo Rotary Club Taco Night fundraiser, cowboys and cowgirls. Next Tuesday at... Howie! Hey, <laughs> hey come on, man. Oh. Quiet down. I'm not any louder than the fireworks are gonna be. Look, I'm just trying to make sure the coach doesn't notice us. I'm already on thin ice. Let's be honest, man. We played like garbage tonight. We were uptight. We were stiff. That the road's getting to us. For the good of the team, man, you need to chill. Right, right. Listen. Off some steam. I'm having a great time. I just want to make sure I keep having a great time by not getting caught. Oh well then. Here's a big old double shot of good time right here. I'll light one end. You like the other. Aim it, let's not hit the bus. Five, four, four three, two, two one. Ah. <laughs> 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 I told you. Oh, I think I'm in love. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, uh, uh, Howie. Uh, Yo, Howie. Oh, oh, Howie. oh God. Oh, um. Uh, yeah, I, I think it's time we uh. Yeah, we're inside. Okay, let's just say that this. Yeah, and then Jerry Masala, young. All right, everybody, listen up, listen up. Unfortunately, fire department says the cause of this fire was most likely fireworks, <laughs> some kind of projectile. Pow! <laughs> okay, and I'm especially bummed because I lost all my cool clothes in the fire. Now the fire department has to go inside the building and make sure it's all safe for us before we return. And guess what? That's time we don't have. That might take all night. Howie! Huh? I'm, uh, well, yeah. Yeah? Did you go to the drugstore? No. Get those breathing strips like I told you? No. I, I mean, yeah, yes. Breathe and clear, sir. All right, good hustle. Thanks, coach. The rest of you guys, 
are gonna hustle onto the bus. And I'm gonna try to figure out who started this fire! What kind of basketball team burns down their own hotel? On the bus. Everybody. You can't leave me hanging like that. <laughs> Wait, what, what you mean? Come to our game again. Da da da, that's all you said. Oh. <laughs> I'm sorry, my bad. Um, I I'm in our game against the Memphis Hustle. It's our last road game, classic. Playing in the old school gym in Nice Town. Yeah, yeah, I'll definitely be there. Can't wait to see you. What's wrong? <sighs> Nothing, just um, the road, this game. You're on the right path, AI. The bigger vision, it's there. Yeah, that's what Big Tooney keeps saying. Big Toonie? That's like seeing Bigfoot or Einstein and they had an encyclopedic knowledge of the Eurostep. You met him? Yeah, yeah, I actually met him a couple times. Okay, and this is the first time that you're telling me? This is the first thing we're talking about when I get into Night's Down. All right, get some sleep. Yeah, yeah, that, uh, that might be a problem. How come? Mm, well, uh, there was a fire at the hotel. What? Are you okay? Yeah, yeah, everybody's, everybody's totally fine. It's just, um, you know, just a crazy accident. Uh, but, you know, we sleep on the bus tonight, so never a dull moment. Ooh, Okache. Then I can remind the...